I'm Tom Wright with your KFM Quick Cast. Republican presidential candidate Donald Trump is headed to the Texas-Mexico border today. He's scheduled to tour the crossing at Laredo. Laredo area border agents were supposed to lead Trump around the area, but the union backed out of the tour this morning. A Trump spokeswoman says he'll visit the border with other agents. Trump sparked controversy last month when he said Mexican immigrants were criminals and rapists. The police chief for the Texas city of May Pearl has been arrested after being accused of pursuing a sexual relationship with a 16-year-old girl. 49-year-old Kevin Coffey turned himself in. He's now facing a number of charges. Parents told police Coffey first contacted the girl through Facebook when she was 14. Coffey was placed on administrative leave with pay on July 13th after search warrants for his home and police station were served. Do you know that movie where the intruder is hiding under the bed? Well, that happened in New Jersey, kind of. Police say an intruder holed up in a, for days in a family's home. He apparently entered through an open door when one of the residents took out the trash. The suspect had dated the homeowner's daughter. The suspect is charged with criminal trespass and burglary and theft for charging several cell phones while in the home. You may soon be able to own a little piece of one of the world's most exclusive cars. The parent company of Ferrari, Fiat Chrysler Automobiles, announced it will spin off the luxury car manufacturer and list shares on the New York Stock Exchange. The IPO is expected by early 2016. The sports car maker is reportedly aiming for a market value of at least $11 billion. For this KFDM QuickCast, I'm Tom Ryan.